General Motors' re-entry to Wall Street definitely triggered a frenzy of enthusiasm. Some feel it's a sign of the future of the U.S. auto industry. Fox Toledo's Heather Miller spoke with a local GM dealer and is live to bring us his reaction. Yeah, it's no secret that times were tough for GM in the not-so-distant past. It's safe to say the impact of GM's comeback stretches beyond shareholders. Every in, everyone in the auto chain will feel it, from suppliers and dealers to customers. I think it's positive. You know, the quicker that GM can get, re, relieve their debt and get owned by, you know, on this, and publicly traded, it's. I think it's a wonderful thing. Joe Mailing, general manager at Dave White Chevrolet, says the GM stock sale is nothing but positive for his business, and business is booming. He says sales of GM products have been excellent, and expects the trend to continue, especially coming off of last year. You know, 2009 was a scary year. You know, we're sitting waiting for a FedEx envelope to tell us whether we're going to stay in business or not. And we've gone from that to 2010 has been a great year for us, and I think 11 will even be better. And the more confidence consumers start to get in us and in in General Motors, the better it's going to be for us. Mailing says sales at Dave White are up 30 percent from last year, and GM just announced year-end incentives on cars like the new Chevy Cruze. That, coupled with new confidence in the company, can't be anything but good. I think if we weren't on their shopping list, we might be now just because of the fact that we are recovering as quickly as we have in GM. I should say GM is recovering as quickly as they are. And I think it gives people, you know, maybe we'll get on a few more shopping lists than we were before. Now 5% of the stocks available were set aside specifically for GM employees, retirees, and dealers to buy. But everyone at Dave White I talked to, they tell me today they were just too busy selling cars to cash in. Reporting live, Heather Miller, Fox Toledo News. All right, thanks, Heather. One person who voted for the GM and Chrysler bailout money was Senator Sherrod Brown. We talked to him today about his reaction to the stock offering. I think that GM is an increasingly attractive investment for people, as it has been through most of its 100-year history, uh, because GM is a company that is again on the rise. Um, they're making good quality cars, as is Chrysler, as is Ford. Senator Brown says GM's revitalization also means jobs for our area. For example, the Chevy Cruze, where the parts and assembly are done in Ohio.